Kita mo naman yung naging resulta ng inyong reporting. At ikaw lang ang nag-report na ganyan. Buti sana kung lahat ng Malacanang Press Corps nag-report ng ganyan, I would say ako nagkamali. Pero you took my statements out of context. Nagpanik ang publiko. Sa panahon ng pandemic, you have to be responsible for what you report. Next question, please. Welcome to Trending Planet. If you're new in this channel, please don't forget to like, subscribe and hit the notification bell for more trending news. Presidential spokesperson Harry Roe K. blew his top in Tuesday's virtual press briefing over alleged erroneous reports about his comments about mass testing. Roe K. singled out a television reporter and railed against her supposed wrong report, which he claimed caused public uproar and panic. The palace official further accused the reporter of not doing the entire nation a service for doing that. CNN Philippines, however, stood firmly behind its May 18 story titled Up to Private Sector to Carry Out Mass Testing, Roe K. says amid limited testing capacity, and found unfortunate the accusation against its correspondent Trisha Terada. Trisha Terada. Hi, Secretary. Good morning, po. Sir, um, I understand the term now that we're using is expanded targeted testing, or that's the direction that we're moving towards to. But sir, um, uh, since uh, since you have a statement yesterday, uh, many reacted in the negative. Uh, nung sinabi pong iiwan yung testing doon sa private sectors, at least doon po yung sa anti, uh, ay, yung, sa, yung sa rapid test po. Pero sir, um, the question now is, uh, bakit po hindi magawa yung mass testing? I understand there is global shortage, but um, the many people are asking, bakit po yung ibang mga bansa, despite the global shortage, nagagawa po nila magkaroon uh, ng mass testing na natitest even the asymptomatic uh, patients po? Is it a problem of budget, um, the loss, uh, or quite the constricting? Mali kasi yung term na ginamit mo, kaya tuloy nagkagulo sa Twitter. Kaya nga po ang pakiusap ko sa ating mga kasama sa media, ingat lang po sa reporting. No? Kasi lumalabas Trish sa report mo, eh, wala tayong expanded testing program. Wala tayong kahit anong programa sa gobyerno na hindi naman totoo. Yung, yung reaction ng tao sa Twitter, ganyan po ang reaksyon pag hindi tayo nag-ingat sa reporting. And although I have to say na ikaw lang naman ang naglabas ng report na ganyan. I have to say that and get it out of my system. So anyway, hindi po mass testing ang ginagawa natin. It is expanded, uh, targeted testing, at wala naman pong bansa sa mundo na lahat ng kanilang mamamayan ay tinetest. Kahapon siguro nagulo ka kasi sinabi ko yung ginagawa nila sa Wuhan. Dahil sa second wave, eh, gusto nilang itest yung 11 million residents of Wuhan. Pero sa Wuhan lang po yun, di nila kakayaan testing ang lahat ng mga Chino dahil billion nga po ang kanilang population. So, nalulungkot ako, Trish, na bagamat dalawang beses na nag-guess sa atin si uh, Vince, uh, Secretary Vince Dizon, eh, ang lumabas pa sa report mo, wala tayong polisiya para sa expanded testing. No? Meron po, kaya nga po inulit ko po muli. At uulitin ko po uli kung gusto mo. No? Pero ang kasagutan po sa tanong ninyo, meron po tayong expanded target testing. Siyempre po, sa simula, mahina po yan. Bago po kasi ito sa sakit na ito, bago yung mga... Teknolohiya, mga laboratories na ginagamit para i-testing sa sakit na ito. Yes, kakaunti tayo nagsimula pero we're aiming now for 30,000. Maling-mali po yung report mo na wala pong kahit anong priority na binibigay ang gobyerno sa testing. Kaya nga po si Vince Dizon, ang titulo niya, Deputy Implementer at saka happy po ng T3, Test, Trace, and Treat. I hope I have made myself very clear. And if you need further instruction or um, education on the country's testing program, please approach me. Pero sa panahon ng pandemya, nakikita po natin kung anong reaksyon sa mga hindi namang tamang mga reports, Trish. Sorry to say so. Mm-hmm. Next question, Sorry, please. Sorry, I have to correct that uh, with your indulgence. I well, you don't have to correct it if you don't want about... to, pero you're not yes. doing the entire nation a service for doing that, no? Uh-huh. And you, you know, sir, I just like to correct that we, I did this report about it. But anyway, sir, moving on. I think you also have to rectify your report, no? Because now... it really caused um, uh, public uproar, no? At mali naman po. Kasi nga po, this has become a public, par- a private partnership. It's not because of lack of funds. It's because everyone gives priority to testing. Kasi yan nga lang po ang ating paraan para malaman kung saan ang ating kalaban. But again, I, 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 I have to say it, no? 
I think I cannot do my job without sabi ng lahat wag ko na raw pansinin Trish, no? hindi I have to call you out kita mo naman yung naging resulta ng inyong reporting at ikaw lang ang nag-report na ganyan buti sana kung lahat ng malakanyang press corps nag-report ng ganyan I would say ako nagkamali pero you took my statements out of context nagpanik ang publiko sa panahon ng pandemic you have to be responsible for what you report next question please Thanks for watching Trending Planet. Please leave your comment below and don't forget to like and subscribe. Keep safe and God bless.